Hey, what's going on guys? My name is Nort. As you can see, we are playing the mission Complications, and this is because I'm going to do an idea which I've noticed a bunch of you guys ask me to do, and this is to see what happens if Michael catches Amanda with the tennis coach in GTA 5, but in this mission, not the one where Michael actually catches her. Because as you all know, Michael is hiding inside the vehicle, and Amanda is in the kitchen with the tennis coach. What we are going to do is we are going to do a few different things in this mission. For example, I do have this mod menu here to try and get Michael to see what Amanda is doing in that mission to see what he would do because I'm pretty certain he is not going to be happy with what Amanda is doing in this mission because she is literally dancing with the tennis coach in the kitchen. So before we get into this I just want to ask you guys to smash that thumbs up button. That would of course be absolutely amazing. Let's try and smash that goal of 2,000, 3,000, let's do 4,000 likes. I know we can do it guys. Everyone just smash that thumbs up button and let's try and smash that goal of 4,000 likes. I am in my pajamas. I do apologize for that. I haven't even got dressed yet or anything else like that. I literally just woke up and made videos. The first method I want to try doesn't actually require mods. What we're going to do is we're going to take the vehicle, we're going to drive it outside, and when Michael starts peeking his head above the seat and when he starts, like, telling us what to do, I'm going to take him back to the house and drive him around the back of the house where the windows are looking into the kitchen. This way, we won't have to use mods or anything else like that, and Amanda and the tennis coach should still be in the kitchen at that point, so Michael will definitely be able to see what's going on. So I'm not too sure what will happen then, but if that doesn't work, then I will just take Michael and place him in the kitchen and see what he does then, because he is not going to be happy whatsoever, guys. No matter what happens, he is not going to be happy at all. Oh, I'm going the complete wrong way. Uh, can we go this way? I think so, maybe? Let me know in the comments, guys, what do you think is going to happen? If Michael catches Amanda, and I promise you guys, it will happen in today's episode, I'm going to make sure that does happen. What do you think happens? What do you think he will do? I can imagine he's going to throw a tantrum, like he's going to just throw the tennis coach out of the house and completely forget the vehicle. And maybe it'll add more suspense to the next mission where he actually catches the tennis coach. Or maybe he'll just be a bit more suspect. He'll be like, hey, what's this guy doing with Amanda? No, get out of my house. You know, maybe not much will happen, but he will still do something. So I'm not too sure. I'm going into this blind. I have no idea whatsoever. So it's about time we find out. Let's do this the interesting way. I'm going to go around a different way so we completely avoid the gardener. If we go around, around the back, oh yeah, if we go around the back, then we'll be able to get into the house that way without alerting anyone. I think we can climb over this and then we just jump straight forward. There we go. <laughs> We're in the garden. Can we see anyone? In the kitchen. Is anyone there? Anyone at all? Amanda, are you there? This is when we see Amanda and the tennis coach. That would be so weird. I just realized they go to the kitchen. So they're in the lounge somewhere. I can't actually see inside the lounge. But they're in the lounge somewhere. And when we go over downstairs, they will move into the kitchen. I just realized. So we can't actually see them in the kitchen yet. So I'm going to climb onto this. We'll do this mission normally. Everything normally. Perfect. Tracy has stormed off into a room. Jimmy is playing a game. Just go and get the car, Franklin. You've got this, dude. You've got this, man. And Amanda and the tennis coach will then move into the kitchen from the lounge. There they are. There we go. Okay, they've moved into the kitchen. Now, what we are going to do is take the vehicle and we're going to drive the vehicle around the back of the house and show Michael exactly what Amanda is doing and see what happens. Because I'm not too sure what's going to happen, but it's going to be interesting nonetheless, guys. Is Michael in there? Yep, there he is. Under the red blanket. So this is the plan. If I quickly go into this... It's my camera view. So if we look in the kitchen, you can see they're still there, even though we're in the vehicle. So if we drive the vehicle around the back of the house, what do you think is going to happen? I'll leave the house quickly. And I need Michael to bring his head over the seat. So come on, Michael. Come on, dude. Come on. Okay, cool. Simeon, hang up. There we go. And I believe Michael will show himself very, very soon. Come on, Michael. We have to go close to the store in all, all my days. I'm so bad at driving. We have to go close to the store in order for Michael to show himself. Because I have tried this a million times. And if you go away from the store, he won't show himself until you go close. So there we go. He's just shown himself. So now we're going to turn around and go all the way back over to his house. And see what he does when he catches Amanda with the tennis coach. And she was there when we left. So they should still be there again. You ready for this, Michael? <laughs> <laughs> he has no idea what's going on. Oh my days. I can't drive this thing. No, come on. He took me out because I went over to his house. What? No, no, that's not fair. That is not fair. I, I just went over to his house and he took me out already. Right, we're, we're doing this again. We are retrying this again. Michael, I'm doing this again. Whether you like it or not, dude, I am doing this again. And we're taking you back over to your house. And you're not taking me out, okay? You are not doing that. 
There we go. There's Simeon. How do I do this with my car? I can't drive. If he takes me out again, I will try this a different way. A more kind of, you know, we're just going to place him inside the kitchen way. Uh, but <laughs> I hope it doesn't get to that. So let's just go around. And there we go. Back over to the house. So there's his house. Can we see through the back window from any of the roads? Can we do that? If we take a look maybe here. Just about. Can we see Amanda and the tennis coach in there? Can we see Amanda and the tennis coach? No, man, it goes too low. Fine, I'm going to just use this. And we're going to drive to there. They're still talking, so I don't think he's going to take me out. Are they there? Oh, they're there! But wait, wait, what? what? So they are there. But they're not, they're not doing anything. I think they're just standing there. There's no animation or anything else like that. They're just standing there in the kitchen. Uh, Michael, can you see that? <laughs> can you see that, dude? They're, they're, they're literally just standing there. They're not doing anything. That is so weird. And Michael isn't saying anything, so he can't see what's going on. Maybe if we go forward, he can take a look. Let, let's go inside the house. I'll just drive inside. How's this? They're literally just standing there. That is so damn confusing. So yeah, there you guys go. If you just drive Michael around the back of the house, they might be standing there. I mean, they're standing there for me. I have no idea why they're just standing there. Maybe they haven't despawned or something. Maybe they're in the process of despawning. But Michael isn't doing anything yet, apart from potentially taking me out. So I'm just going to let him do that. So I'll just <laughs> drive around his house. <laughs> All right, it was nice knowing you, Michael. Can we roll this? Yeah, we can. And... Nope! How? How? How are we okay? How is the car okay? <laughs> oh, dude, I'm gonna keep the car upside down and see what Michael does. Wait, what happened? The car was destroyed. It was not destroyed. It was just upside down, okay? I beg to differ. This next part, this next phase, this new plan, it can't fail, guys, okay? It can't fail 100%. Oh, the weather really isn't that good today. And now what we're going to do is stand in the hallway... And there they are. So this is what's going to happen, guys. I'm going to spawn down Michael. So I'll place him down right down here. So Michael, 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 Michael. Where is he? There he is. So I've just placed down Michael. I'm now going to become that pedestrian. And now because I've done this, as you guys can see, we are officially Michael in the game. You know, it's the official one. So Franklin is just over there. Oh my days. They're still there. They're still there. <laughs> Oh my gosh, guys. We're going to literally... Oh my... Okay, right. We're just going to walk into the kitchen and see what happens. Oh. Oh, wait. No, no, no. We were Michael. We weren't Franklin. We were Michael. We were Michael. That doesn't make sense. So even if you become Michael and walk into the kitchen to catch them, it still goes over to Franklin. Let's do this again. I've got another idea, guys. I'm going to... <laughs> There's two Franklins now. <laughs> There's two of them. Oh my gosh. I'm going to go into player options, model changer, and we're going to become Michael, and I'm going to switch him again when we're in the scene, and see if that does anything for some reason? That is so strange. Alright, I'm going to walk into the kitchen and see what happens. Once again, we're still Franklin. I'm trying to change into Michael again, and we still remain as Franklin. That is so strange. So even if you become Michael and walk into the kitchen, it will still change over to Franklin. So I guess the only other thing we could do is to place Michael in the kitchen and see what he does. So I'm going to do the same thing, become Michael, then go back to Franklin, which will basically place Michael as the official uh, protagonist. There we go. I've just placed down Michael. Now we're going to become his pedestrian. And now because we're the real Michael, it means when we go back over to Franklin, which I'm going to do now, that Michael is now the official and the real Michael. So if I bump into him... We were just caught again. We were caught again. Come on, what did we even do? Was that Mike? I think Michael caught us, actually, because he became the official one. Let me try this again. That was so confusing. I'm going to place Michael in the kitchen. Slow. There we go, he's in the kitchen. <laughs> oh, dude, I've got an awesome idea. I'm going to place him, like, right here. Once again, he's still not doing anything. That's so strange. Why isn't he doing anything? So look at this. Michael is just literally standing there, not doing anything. Like, what are you doing, Michael? I'm so confused. I am. I was expecting Michael to do something. And even just driving around the back of the house, we still saw them, but they weren't doing anything. They were just standing there. And again, Michael didn't do anything, which is so damn strange. So what I'm going to do, I'm just going to walk into the kitchen again. And this time, I believe the scene will include Michael. Oh, they still haven't noticed me. What is going on? Oh, there we go. <laughs> Michael's just standing there. <laughs> oh my gosh, look, 
once again, Michael is standing there not doing a single thing. That is so damn strange. So if you guys are wondering what happens if Michael catches Amanda with the tennis coach in the kitchen, this is what happens. And no matter what you try and do, he won't care whatsoever, which I am really surprised at. So unfortunately, guys, I'm going to end the episode here. But either way, it has been an absolute blast. I have learned something new in today's episode. I thought Michael would do something, but clearly he does not care whatsoever. So if you guys did enjoy this episode, be sure to smash that thumbs up button. That would, of course, be absolutely amazing. And of course, guys, I recommend you press that subscribe button just below this video so you don't miss out on awesome stuff like this on a daily basis. And if you want to see me do anything else in GTA 5, it can be an idea, a challenge, an experiment, anything you want to see me do, just comment your idea in the comments below. And you never know, guys, your idea might make it into another video. But guys, thank you so much for watching. My name is Nort, and until next time, stay absolutely awesome. I'll see you guys in the next video.